What's up guys and welcome back to our classic zombie series where I go back and play all the zombies games and maps that I've missed out on throughout the years. And we're on to our final map here in BO4 in our final Treyarch zombies map. So today we're gonna be playing Alpha Omega for the very first time. Okay, here we are on Alpha Omega. What is this? Are we outside of Moon? Do we go up here? Oh, is this Nuketown? They made Nuketown again? At least they like expanded the neighborhood. You know, as a kid, you know, playing like Black Ops 1 and 2, playing on Nuketown, I always wondered what the rest of the neighborhood would look like if you could actually walk in it. So this is pretty cool. I wonder if it's going to be as difficult as the last Nuketown Zombies map. Okay, so Blue House or Orange Yellow House. Let's go Blue House. Oh, is this the thing from Moon? Is that the tower that's in like the middle or the, the pyramid? What's in the backyard? Hello, ma'am. Wait, can I knife your head off? Oh, you can. Sick. Oh, wait, there's a button. I press the button. Access denied. Whatever. We'll figure it out. Oh, there's the box. Hello, sir. Let's hit the box for our first gun. Why not? Give me something good. Okay, the Essex. I said something good. Not a Red Rider BB gun. All right, box. Let's try this again. Give me something good. Okay, the Moog. The Moog. Whatever it's called. Why does it give me like only starter weapons? Can't you start with this weapon? Anything in here? Oh, you see that? See in the x-ray? That's the dog in me. We have our perk here. I'm pretty sure that's going to be, uh, what is it? Last stand, final stand. I haven't played this game in a minute. It says powers this way. Let's just go ahead and turn on power. Then we'll explore the rest of the map. Population four. Don't think so, buddy. Looks like it's just me. Oh, there's dog round on this. Oh, there's power. Let's go. What's up, dogs? Are they electric? What the hell? Now this is population 99. Oh, is it like the last uh, nuke town we're in that shed? Oh, there's the power up still. So after I get 99 kills, does the power up change? Is the Bowie knife in here? Let's buy this. Oh no, it's Galvin Knuckles. That's probably better, actually. So we've already seen one perk machine. So that means that the perks don't spawn from the sky. They don't come crashing down in this one, which is good. But I did like that little element of like surprise of for what perk you're going to get. So let's grab our first perk. Oh, it's Dying Wish. That's what it's called. Okay, what do we miss over here? Yeah, every one of these buildings just decked out with equipment. What the hell are they doing here? Can we go down here? Access denied. Everything's locked down. But besides that, not much going on in this house. Oh wait, no, there's upstairs. What's up here? The President's. Oh, shit. There's a ray gun Mark III in there or Mark II. I, I don't remember which one. This map isn't that big. We should be able to find all of our shield parts. Is there even a shield on here? What did I pick up? It looks like half of a dish. I'm assuming there's a shield. I hope there is. Let's grab some extra ammo for our shotgun and try to find out where the rest of our perks are and pack a punch. It can't be too far away. Let's check out this little teal house. There's a jail cell in here. Why would they need a jail cell? No, 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 no. Oh, dying wish just saved me. And I still hit my, my gobble gum anyways. My tonic, whatever they're called in this game. Probably grab Galvin Knuckles. And now let's actually take a look in here. What's in the backyard? Probably another door that we can't access. Yeah, everything's locked down. There's teleporters too. Uh-oh. Wraith fire, go. No. All right, well, this is our first down of the day. Serving it up Gary's way. Oh, shit. I don't know if I can make it out of here. Let's do this. Catch him on fire. And still go down. Okay, we have two downs. I forgot this how the game works. I just need like two more kills and I can get out of here with my field upgrade. Or we can just run out. Give me dying wish back, please. Thank you. Let's check out Yellow House. There's another perk in here. Oh, they expanded the backyard. I go down here? I can. What? There's a whole bunker. Oh, this goes way down. Uh-oh. I got the sativa blowing through the vents down here. So what? Can I just not be down here? Oh, no, I can. This is pretty sick. Oh, there's a trap. We got... Oh, shit. Oh, there's Pack-A-Punch. It's all the way here in the basement. Well, that's not creepy at all. Generators. Okay, let's go this way. This map's a lot larger than I thought it was going to be. Enable ventilation systems. Okay, well, maybe that'll get the sativa out of there. Let's grab stamina up. Never mind, I'm broke. What the fuck are you? Are these just glowing Nova crawlers? Oh, we have to survive 30 more seconds? No, I don't think we can do it. Wait, we're doing it. We're living. We're surviving. Oh my God, the Nova Crawlers can shoot. Stop hitting me. Stop it. No. Okay, well, that was fun. I'm gonna go look up a guide and then we're gonna try this again. All right, I just got done watching a damn near half hour guide and it took uh, until the very last map of this game for me to figure out that I can put attachments on my weapon. So that's pretty cool. But there actually is a whole lot to do on this map. You can get power on. 
obviously. Uh, to get pack a punch on, I'm gonna do that vent thing, but I actually survive. And you can get like elemental ray guns. So we might try to do that. I think we're gonna start small and work on getting power on first. But also, apparently you can get a knife on the strafe and this is still like a one-shot kill meleeing with this. So we're gonna use that for a bit. And also there's these codes laying around that we can get some sort of like civil protector. I think it's called like Adam or something. A whole lot of shit going on in this map. Let's go ahead and throw power on. Let's try to get this round down to one zombie while still getting as many points as we can. I think we already are down to one zombie. Okay, we're moving on. Let's head down into the bunker. I didn't see this part of it the first time we went through. This is a sick little diner. And let's go ahead and fix the ventilation system. And I was told to leave the zombie here. Don't kill any of the other zombies and just go after Nova Crawler. So that's what I'm going to do. Hopefully I can actually survive this time. This is so much better with the knife on the pistol. It makes it so much easier. Okay, looks like we fixed it. And we have a whole bunch of zombies to show for it. Ventilation unsuccessful. Oh, so this is where we need to go back up and fix it. Gotcha. Okay, now power's on up here. All right, now let's try to build the shield. Oh, get out of here, Nova Crawler. And now you're an electric crawler. Is that why the, the hellhounds and everything in this map are different elemental types? Because you can change the, the elemental types on the ray gun? This whole map just elemental type based? Let me in here. Got our other part. We just need one more piece, and that's down in the bunker. It's somewhere down here. I just gotta find it. And I downed myself like a genius. I was trying to slowly train the zombies around so I could go back to beds and I ended up cornering myself. So that's cool. Round four, already down. And we're gonna go down again, I think. Yep, looking like it. Oh, wait. No, nope, we're chilling. I mean, not chilling, but we're alive, which qualifies as chilling. Gotta be alive to chill. And we are not chilling. I'm throwing the game. Maybe I should have dwindled the round down. Oh, there's our final piece for the shield. And now we can finally build it. Give it here. Now we got to build the teleporter. There's one of our parts. There's another. And our final part is right here. And we're going to build our teleporter right here. I'm doing literally everything like verbatim in the guide. So we can set it down right here or we can pick it up. I don't know exactly what to do with it, but we have it. All right, now we're going to try to get the silver protector for this map. One of our codes is going to be in here. 8047. Our other code is somewhere in here. They said it's under a stack of papers. Is it this? Yeah, it is. 0943. And they said our first code doesn't change, and that's 7626. So let's go ahead and try to put all these codes in and see if it works. Huge problem. I can't figure out where the computer's at that I'm supposed to be putting this in at. I guess we can just repair the ventilation, or at least attempt to. There we go. That should be all fixed. We gotta do it for this one as well. Almost got it. There we go. I'm just going to do this for every house. There we go. Greenhouse is done. Maybe it's in yellow house. I haven't been in there yet. No computer in here that I'm seeing, but let's go ahead and repair this ventilation unit. There we go. I think we have Pack-A-Punch on now. Okay, so this whole time I needed one of these keys and I needed a code from this drawer. 3992. Oh, and we grabbed a part off of there too. And it's saying I need to end the round after turning Pack-A-Punch on. So let's go ahead and do that. Now let's try to get this round back down to one zombie. All right, we got one zombie left now. So I'm pretty sure this is where we're supposed to go to activate it, but the panel's like not on. Oh, do I access it there? There we go. You'll have to win my trust. Find the access codes and bring them back to me. Land of opportunity. Hey, well, good thing for you, computer. I already have the access codes. How do I do it, though? Seven, six, two, six, enter. The project toy soldier granted. So you have access to that now. So now he wants the Sawyer code, which is eight, zero. Zombie, fuck off for a second. So we got every code in now. I don't know how to call them in, but we have it done. Let's try to get some perks now. We're going to need a tortoise. Give me that. Stamina up's down here somewhere. There it is. No, that's time slip. Either way, we'll take it. All right, so now what we can do while we're waiting to get enough money to get stamina up is we can go ahead and start looking for some TVs. We have to activate them, kill some zombies near it, and then it'll give us numbers for a code. There's going to be four different TVs in random spots. I'm pretty sure our first one's over here by Yellow Hoss. I could have swore I saw one on over here. It might be this one. Yep, there it is. The Ray Gun Mark II. So there's one zombie, and we'll start filling it up with the rest of these guys. Still needs more, though. It's still hungry. Do you work for the TV? Oh, it does. Sick. So our first number is one. I got to write that down. Here's our TV. Got an APD control. Get it started up. Another one. Oh, shit. I lose. Game over. Let me out. Let me out. Let me out. Please, bro. Please, bro. Okay. Barely survived that. No idea how. I accidentally hit temporal gift instead of anywhere but here. But our dying wish saved my ass. Give me stamina up right now. Now we got to find our last TV. Our next TV is right here. Let's activate it. Is that it? 
eight. And our last number is going to be right here. Let's turn this TV on. Okay, what's our last number? Six. One, one, eight, six. So now if we go put that code into the computer, we'll get our ray gun frame. But we need to grab a few parts. So we already have one of them, which is like some sort of wire. We need to find the other two, which are down in the bunker. And we're trying to get enough money so I can get my shotgun pack a punch real quick. Because I'm already low on ammo and I might as well just get a pack a punch instead of buying more. So let's do that real quick. Bring it here. Oh, where's this pack a punch camo? Let's take a look. Eh, eh, kind of underwhelming. It's like piss yellow almost. Not a fan. Is this it? Yep. Got it. And our next one should be somewhere over here. And there's our last part. There we go. Now we have all of our parts. So we build this in one of the main houses. I can't remember which one. I think it's this one. Yep. Where's that crafting table? Right here. There we go. So, Treyarch, are you encouraging me to mod this thing? Oh, Dempsey just said, so, Treyarch, are you encouraging me to mod this thing? Is there even custom mods or maps for BO4? I don't even know. Nice little fourth wall break. Now let's try to grab our ray gun frame. It's 1186 is our code. 1186. Enter. Ooh, now we can grab one of those. So give me that. Now what they want us to do is get the ray gun elemental parts. Uh, there is a way to get a free ray gun, which we can if we get these galvan knuckles, but uh, I'm too broke right now. And technically it's not free if I have to buy the galvan knuckles. All right, we finally got enough for them. Let's grab the galvan knuckles and I'm gonna go ahead and turn on subtitles for this part. So we need to find a TV. Oh wait, there it is. We found it, first try. We need to kill a zombie with galvan knuckles right by it. So come here. There we go. So C0645, let me write that down. D0515, D0515. A1200, F0830. I think I got that last one wrong. One more time for me, TV. Maybe it's 8300, something like that. And well, we had the four numbers. I will be able to figure it out, hopefully. Okay, so this is house C. We need to put the clock at 645, no AR. I think that's right. Oh, we got a new weapon. Let's go. That's probably better than our pistol. Okay, so now we need to find house D. This is house D. And we have to set the clock to 515. There we go. Red house countermeasure. I don't know what that is. And okay, now we need to find whatever house is A. Oh, okay. So that's B house. This is A. Got it. There we go. So yellow house countermeasure enabled. Don't know what that means. And our last one is the one that I don't know the time to. I might end the recording, go back and look at the footage and figure it out. So I'll be right back. Okay, I went back back and watched it it's 8 30 i need to set it at and it's f so which building is f so it's a b c d e and then i want to just gonna assume this one's f i don't see any uh indicators that it's f it's gonna take a while that should be it okay so we have all of that now all right, i went back to watch the footage again i did not hear the e one go off but i heard b and that one was three so did i miss the one that i needed that's disappointing okay so i have it for green i'm just gonna trial and error out the last one a stop clock is right twice a day oh wait it's just constantly spinning. Oh, it just gave me it. Sick. All right, well, I'm getting rid of the swordfish for the ray gun. Let's go. We actually got it. That took way longer than it should have, but I got it. Good thing I had it recorded so I can go back and see where I messed up. All right, now we can start working on getting those elemental parts. We got to repack a punch this so we get an ammo mod on it. What do we got? firebomb okay so according to the guide we gotta look for a glowing cabinet it can be in greenhouse yellow house or down in the lounge how do i get back to the lounge okay let's see if it's over here it says it would be right there but it's not it's gotta be over here yep there it is let's shoot it That'll open up. We'll grab that ammo canister. And one of these houses is going to have some flames coming out of it. There it is. So now we got a gender reveal going on at this house. We have to somehow get the wraith fire to land on top of it. Oh, I almost first tried that. Let's try this. Okay, that was nowhere near. Now I have to wait for my wraith fires to be back. All right, well, our round ended, but I do have another wraith fire. Let's try this again. If that makes it. Oh, let's go. Only took three tries. So now we got to put our canister in there and fill up this soul box. I'm going to die. Give me that. Okay, I got a full power. Dying wish save my ass again. Oh, I think we filled it up. Give me that. Now let's throw that in there. Let's go. We got the ray gun mark to Z. Now what does this do? Ooh, it shoots like a shotgun. Let's try to get a better look at it. Ooh. This thing's crazy. All right, let's try to get the other ones. We have to go repack a punch this though. Try to get a 
different ammo mod on it. What do we get? Okay, brain rot. All right, now this one's gonna be a little weird. We have to find a nice steaming pile of shit. And it's kind of like the, the Maurer Easter egg where you get like Klaus's hands. We need to get a turn zombie to go and hit it. And I'm pretty sure I saw the pile behind Yellow House over here. Yep, there it is. Zombie, if you could. Okay, you didn't get turned. Could you get turned? There we go. Thank you, sir. I'll take that. And now we have this orb. Which flew somewhere. Oh, it's right here. Okay, so let's place down our telepad. Shoot it again. And it teleported. Now we need to go find where it teleported off to. It's gonna be at any telepad, I'm pretty sure. If I was an orb, where would I be? Oh shit, it's the transit guy. What's going on, pal? They got him locked up down here. Oh, I found it. Let's go. Let's throw down the telepad. Let's shoot it again. Let's teleport with it. Now what? Shoot it again? Oh, did it give me the canister? I don't see it. Did I pick it up? All right, so now apparently it teleported down the storage. Oh, there it is. Let's put the canister down and start filling it up. Is this our guy? Is that Sergeant Adam? That's scary. I didn't know he was in here the whole time. We almost have this one filled up. Oh, I think we do. Let's go. So let's put this ray gun back. Let's grab another frame. Let's craft the Mark II Y. There we go. So let's take a quick look at it. Oh, shit. This looks sick. Doesn't have that many bullets in it, but it takes out quite a few zombies. Let's go repack a bunch of our shotgun and see what our next ammo mod is so we can get that next elemental ray gun. I'm pretty sure all that's left is the cryo freeze and kilowatt. Please don't give me something I already have. Okay, we got kilowatt. All right, this one seems pretty easy to do. We just got to go to generator, find some sparking panel and shoot that. Oh, it's right here. Easy. Give me that canister. And we have to find an electric pole that's sparking yellow let me take a step back to see if i can find it i don't see any of them sparking yellow i've been lied to maybe it is this one can i actually hit it though do i have the range for it maybe i picked the wrong weapon to have pack a punch oh yeah so we got it we have a yellow orb there now which one is our next one? Oh, it's this right here okay our round ended unfortunately okay we got a yellow orb there what's our next one right here come on how are none of these hitting Wait, what's happening? It made like a bubbling sound. Okay, I got that one. It only took like 18 shots. Most out of ammo, so this dog round's perfect. Give me that. Is this our next one? I feel like it has to be. They're all connected to that one. The ventilation went off. Is that what happened? Is that that bubbling sound I heard? Yeah, I have to redo all the vents. That's stupid. There we go. Got it. Now we finally have all the telephone poles. Let's toss that bad boy in here and fill it up. Is it full now? It is. Let's go. Let's put this one away and let's build our next ray gun. There we go. So once some zombies start spawning in, we'll see what this thing can do. All right, let's see. Oh, wait, this thing just lasers. It's almost like the DIE shockwave, like the electric version of that. Oh, and it replenishes ammo. I'm already almost back to 100. Let's go. But did it even kill the zombies or just do damage to them? It killed the dogs immediately. These it kind of just does damage to. This is like a point machine. A double points with this thing? Ooh. We got one last one to get, and that's the cryo freeze one. Please give me cryo first try. Oh, no way. It actually listens. Now we got to be on the lookout for zombies that already have like some sort of blue on it. Like they're already partially frozen. We shoot them once with our cryo freeze gun and then we have to melee them. They're going to drop some like blue goo. Then we got to pick that up, bring it to the lab. Can I get out? Ooh, I was getting blocked there for a second. But we got to pick that up, bring it to the lab, and then we'll have our cryo gun. I forgot the most important part. I need to get the canister first. I've just been running around shooting zombies. We need to find a little drawer that's already glowing blue so we can grab our canister. You guys can just eat one of those for all I care. Okay, I don't think it's in here. Is it in here? I'm not seeing it. So is it in here? Yep, right there. Shoot that open. Give me that. And I'm going to anywhere but here because there's a lot of shit going on. All right. Now we got to look for those zombies. The zombies that contain goo. I don't see a single zombie with the blue on it. Am I doing this wrong? Did I not pick it up? Maybe I didn't pick up the canister. No, I for sure picked it up. Okay. So I just went back and checked on the guide. I needed to be in the bunker. So it's this guy that we need to get. There we go. Give me your goo. Oh, there's another one. Get out of here. Give me your goo. Thank you. We need one more. Oh, there he is. Give it, give it, give it. I think I got it. And we have to bring it to something right here. There we go. And we have another soul box to fill up. No, 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 no. Don't knock me. 
I will be pissed. Thank you, Dying Wish, for saving my life. Okay, now I'm gonna die. I, I hit the teleporter. There's nothing else I could do. What? There's a Nova Crawler right there and it killed me. All right, I, I don't think I'm gonna go back and try to do that all again. We got pretty far. We almost got every single elemental uh, ray, ray gun. We had the Brain Rot one, the Kilowatt one, and we had... What was it? The firebomb one. We were this close to getting the last one. And if I had it, we, we would have had all four. Damn, that's so disappointing. Anyways, that took way too long to do, so I'm not going to do it again. But we made it pretty far here on our second attempt. I'm pretty proud of myself. You know, we, we got a lot done. But overall review of the map, I think it's, it's pretty good. I think this is a nice upgrade over Nuketown. It's got some pretty complicated steps to actually get something done, so it takes a while. But... It is cool that we get to see the rest of the neighborhood. We get to see all underground in the bunker, which is really neat. I don't know. It's a pretty cool map. But with that, I'm going to go ahead and end today's video. So if you guys like this, you want to see more, go and leave a like on it. And you don't dislike. If you're new here, please consider subscribing. Put all kinds of COD content throughout the week. And if you want to keep up with me outside of YouTube, you can follow my Instagram and my Twitter. Links to those are down in the description below. Also, a link to my Discord will be there if you want to join that. But that's going to be it for me today. I'll see you guys next time. Later.